on guys welcome back to gadgets 123 thanks for checking out the channel thanks for checking out this video okay this is in the unboxing of the unident automotive video recorder now this camera is definitely on the budget side so if you're looking for something that is small compact and definitely on the budget side this might be the one for you we're gonna go ahead and unbox it test it out and see what comes in this package so let's get started <music> so let's go ahead and unbox this bad boy right here so again this one i got in a budget side i'm going to link that in the description if you guys are interested in an entry level uh camera for your automobile this might be the one for you again stated this is definitely on a budget side so you're going to see some uh cutbacks compared to other ones in regards to pro um quality but it does have a lot of features that you might be interested in so let's go ahead and start and unbox this thing right now here's the camera it's very small man this thing is tiny i seen other ones that are a little bit smaller but this one's basically uh right there next to the ones i've seen all right that's pretty much it so let's get rid of the box so again what comes in this package is the following you get you get the car adapter which is right here now this one is a um the older model i don't know if you guys could see it the older model of the uh usb cable um as you could see right there is the ones you used to use back on the uh, blackberry models there so again you get this cable this is about six feet long maybe a little bit longer which is good especially depending on what kind of vehicle you have this could definitely be uh working for your truck for your car um for your van whatever this thing is long enough to pretty much uh, fit any kind of car and windshield and mount or wherever you're planning on putting this actual camera in uh you get the other this is the um about three feet yeah it's about a three feet cable now this one is if you want to transfer information to your computer from the micro sd card that comes included in this package pretty good to have this handy as well you get the actual mount which is this one right here and you get the actual camcorder which is this one before we go over that you get a whole bunch of reading materials which is right here as well now move aside from these things right here the actual accessories let's go to the actual camera itself now the actual camera itself is very very tiny as you can see it's definitely um compared to a phone let me just try to get a phone right here for you guys to compare it to this is the iphone 6 so check out how tiny it is and this is the small iphone 6 this this thing is literally the size <laughs> the width of an actual iphone 6 right there look how small it is so this thing is tiny um very light probably about three to four ounces at most now it does have a uh slot and uh, you do get an eight gigabyte uh micro sd card for uh, recording purposes but you could go up to 32 gigs uh micro sd card to store more uh, video so keep that in mind you can't go any further than 32 so 32 would be basically the max so when it comes to the actual camera itself as you can see it's completely tiny as we stated before now it does have the usb uh, port on the right hand side on the other side it does have the slot for the micro us uh, micro sd card slot now it's very small you kind of need to have nails or basically use like a little toothpick to kind of push it in push it out you do get that 8 gig micro sd card included but i do suggest uh, if you're going to be planning on using this on your uh, daily commute to get at least a 32 gigabyte uh, micro sd card um in regards to the camera itself it does have a built-in speaker speaker uh overall is very poor in regards to sound quality so don't think you're going to be getting some nice crisp sounds from that speaker itself now in the back you do have the 1.5 um lcd screen color lcd screen with the function buttons on the right and on the left you do have the up and down button here this is basically the menu option this is the confirm button to select whatever option you want and this is the mode uh the different mode options now this camera has a couple of different modes it has uh recording mode photo mode and playback mode so you, you could play around with any of those three options that it has available uh built in now this again is the power button that uh, you could turn off 
and on the actual camera itself now you do have a couple different options in regards to features it does have a option to select different uh resolutions from 1080 to 720 do suggest you keep it on 1080 um, also has a, a sleep mode and also has the collision mode as we explained earlier in this video so again it does have a lot of different options in regards to features uh, especially for the budget price you're getting something uh, pretty good in uh, definitely a small price compared to other more expensive cameras but keep in mind that if you're looking to use this especially during the night time this might not be the camera for you now this is going to be something for your daily commute in regards to driving during the day then this might be perfect for your needs so we're going to show you some of the videos that we recorded in regards to uh, how it looks during the day and also during the night and let you guys decide for yourself so let's get started with that guys here is how it's set up right now so as you could see it's literally right there uh very small again as explained earlier in the video uh i like the the actual cable is actually really long it's probably about six feet or more so if you have one of the bigger trucks uh you shouldn't have a problem connecting it to your actual uh, adapter power adapter but again we're gonna go ahead and test it out and see how it works right now it's recording i'm gonna take a little drive right now it's getting uh, in the evening now, so it's getting a little darker. It's not as bright as before, so we're still going to see how it looks, and then we're going to take a little drive later on uh, when it gets darker. All right, let's check it out. All right, guys, so again, it looks pretty good. It um, It's very compact, which is good, so we're going to see the picture quality a little bit later on this video and see how it looks once it's played on my computer. I'm going to try to play on my computer just because the screen's so small on the actual device. It's going to be hard to kind of show you how it looks from the actual screen. So we're going to play in the computer and see how it is. But as stated before, a uh, very budget camera, especially if you're looking for something uh, on the budget side. Now keep in mind that, again, it, it lacks a couple of things. It is uh, 1080p as uh, stated before. Just keep in mind it's not, uh, you know, clarity wise, it's okay especially during the daytime and around this time evening it looks good um, but then the um, actual image starts uh, deteriorating uh, as soon as it hits uh, night unless unless it's a really 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 well lit area you're gonna have a lot of problems you know getting a license plates or anything like that when it comes to uh, having it on night mode so keep that in mind Thanks for watching gadgets one two three thanks for watching this video like comment subscribe guys like comment subscribes and if you're interested in us reviewing some other products definitely leave that on the comments below we'll try to get those products for you and review it and unbox it and uh, give us give you our basically our uh, opinion on the actual product so again thanks for watching gadgets one two three thanks for watching this unboxing of the uniden automobile video recorder dc11 and i'll see you guys on the next video Thank you.